Cheers, everybody. Welcome back to another beer review with your host, JB. That's right, JB, that's me. This one, we've got a collaboration. I've had my eye on this for a while and suddenly found out that this week it was a limited seasonal release. So decided to jump on it. Just jump on it straight away. So the beer we've got is a Full Circle Brew Company collaboration with Beer by Numbers. Um, go on, bugger off. Beer by Numbers, a uh, very solid brewery, I have to say. I've enjoyed all their beers, to be honest. They've, got, they've had beers in Tesco, is it? And Sainsbury's and m and I think. So, yeah, and we've got an Imperial Ghost, and it's a blueberry and pomegranate... Po Blueberry and Pomegranate Imperial Ghost. And it is a can of that number one. Super smashing great. Clocking it at 7.5% ABV. Strongest ghost I've ever had, I think. Um, so there you go. I'll give it a, a little... There's the back side. Have I got any information for you lovely people out there? Well, I have. I've got Mosaic Hops. Uh, fruit is Blueberry and Pomegranate. And that is all there is. If you want to check out Full Circle Brewery, uh, they're based in Newcastle on Walker Road in Newcastle. Let's get that over there. So let's just crack it open, shall we? Crack it open. See what it's all about. I do like a good ghost. Oh, yeah. Lovely. A lovely medley. A lovely medley of pomegranate and blueberry. It smells like uh, fruits of the forest yogurt to me, in a way. It's that type of thing going on. So let's pour it out like you do. And see what... Oh, look at that. Berry red. It looks absolutely gorgeous. It's making my mouth water. Just looking at the colour of this, it's just... Oh, that looks absolutely wonderful. Pure fruit juice, isn't it? It's like you stuck a load of fruit in a blender. And this is what you get. This is what you get, boys and girls. Look at that. Beautiful. Let's get a whiff of it. And again, lots of berryness, goodness there. And then you're picking up something slightly else as well you pick up a slight vineness for me hidden in the background but it smells gorgeous my mouth is salivating i'm gonna go in cheers everybody That is banging. That is really good. Really, really good. Um, first of all, my mouth is just dripping with saliva. <laughs> and who's that cook? He used to go like, he used to do a cookery show. Oh, what's his name? And by the end of the show, after he's been talking about food, you can really hear his, his mouth salivaing that he couldn't pronounce anything probably. Aisley Harriet, that's him. Anyway, I'm going off at one there. Do you see that? I just drifted off away from the beer with you. I'll just go in again. Mashed up berries. Pomegranate is there. Not really that tart, but it's just a nice... It's just a nice marry of flavours of that pomegranate and blueberry. Is there a boss of the show in this? Is, is there, you know, a flavour outdoing the other? No. They're quite well balanced, quite well mixed together. Um, on the back end, a slight doughy feel on the back end. You can just pick it up. Um, but it's absolutely gorgeous. It is. It feels thick. It feels concentrated. 
But my word. It's absolutely lovely. Now, ghosts, for me, are quite low in ABV, if I remember rightly. And me being the person I am, I like big, you know, tasting beers, you know, wallop. I've always liked ghosts, so there's a slight character to them which I really like. And I've always thought to myself when I've had them, you know, wouldn't it be great to have, you know, a very much stronger one with a bit of balls and a real thick body to it. And this is exactly what it is. It's got a bit of balls. There's a nice thickness to this. Now, I haven't overdone it with the flavour. I quite like that. It's not that tart. It's not that sour. It's just got a nice drinkability about it. Now, 7.5% in this, I'm telling you now, boys and girls, you can't pick any of that up at all. It's, it's just nothing there. You know, it is like a very much a concentrated fruit beer. But it's it's done so well. It's absolutely lovely. It is. It is. I can't. I'm glad I picked it up. I really have. Again, again. My mouth is watering. <laughs> it's beautiful. There's not much more to, else to say about it, but go out and get one while you can. Number one. Beer, uh, brew by numbers. Is it brew by numbers? Yep, not beer by numbers. Brew by numbers. Um, full circle collaboration. It is a banger. I love it. I really do. I really do. I'm so glad I picked it up. It's banging. Thank you very much for watching this beer review. Get hold of that while you can, because it is lovely. And see all of you again on another one. Cheers.